everybody. My name is Alex Toddling. I'm the second participant in the Neuralink study, and I'm here to count us down to the demo. In five, four, three, two, one. Neuralink dnes ľuďom umožňuje ovládať veci myšlienkami. Z hustoty talentu ma štípe v hlave. Celú firmu tvorí len 300 ľudí. Vďaka vybudovaniu základnej platformy technológie a jej 100% vertikálnej integrácii od neurónov až po pixely na počítači, budeme vedieť získať informácie a ukladať myšlienky kdekoľvek, kedykoľvek, súkromne a potichu. Welcome to the Neuralink uh, presentation. This is an update for uh, the progress of the Neuralink team. It's been an incredible amount of progress. Part of this presentation is about demystifying the, the brain. Um, it is a remarkable organ. I mean, we are the brain, basically. And your experiences are these neurons firing uh, with uh, trillions of, of synapses um, that somehow lead to conscious comprehension of the world. Uh, this is something that we have only begun to understand. We're really just barely at the beginning of understanding of what is the nature of consciousness. Like, we don't know what, the real, the real answer is we don't know what consciousness is. Um, but with uh, Neuralink and uh, the progress that the company's making, we'll begin to understand a lot more about consciousness. Um, and what does it mean to, to be? So what we're, we're, we're creating here with a Neuralink device is a generalized input-output uh, technology for the brain. So uh, it's how do you get information into or out of the brain um, and do so in a way that does not damage the brain or you know, cause any negative side effects. Uh, so it's a very hard problem. What we're doing with Neuralink is dramatically increasing the bandwidth by um, many orders of magnitude. So you can, you can it, uh, a human bandwidth out, output is less than one bit per second over the course of a day. What we're talking about here is, is going from maybe one bit per second to ultimately megabits and then gigabits per second. Um, and the ability to do conceptual, uh, consensual telepathy. So, uh, but e even for input, we, we think that can be dramatically increased uh, to, to the gigabit plus level. Um, your ability to communicate is very limited by how fast you can talk and how fast you can type. Um, and what we're talking about is unlocking that potential uh, to enable you to communicate, uh, like I said, thousands, perhaps millions of times faster than is, is currently possible. This is an incredibly profound breakthrough. Uh, this would, This would be a fundamental change to what it means to be a human. Zaujímavý záber na najväčší mozog planety. This is just tip of the iceberg. Our end goal is to really build a whole brain interface. And what do we mean by whole brain interface? We mean being able to listen to neurons everywhere be able to write information to neurons anywhere, be able to have that fast data wireless transfer to enable that high bandwidth connection from our biological brain to the external uh, machines, and be able to do all of this with fully automated surgery, as well as uh, enable 24 hours of usage. Our North Star metrics is one, increasing the number of neurons that we can uh, interface with, and second, to expand to many uh, diverse areas, any parts of the brain. And in 2026, not only are we going to triple the number of uh, the electrodes from 1,000 to 3,000 for more capabilities, we're planning to have our first blind sight participant to enable navigation. And all this is to say that we're really building towards a set of 
fundamental foundational technology that would allow us to have hundreds of thousands, if not millions of channels with multiple implants for whole brain interfaces that could actually solve not just these debilitating neurological conditions, but be able to go beyond the, the limits of our biology. Here's Alex shooting another person. Right. Oh, dear God. Um, as we advance the Neuralink devices, uh, you should be able to actually have uh, full body con control and sensors from an Optimus robot. So you could basically inhabit an Optimus robot. It's not just the hand, um, the, whole, the whole thing. Um, so you could like basically mentally remote into an Optimus robot and, and uh, be kind of cool. The future's gonna be weird. Um, <laughs> but, and, <laughs> But, but pretty cool. Um, so um, so that it goes far beyond just operating a, ro a robot hand, but replacing limbs and, and having kind of a whole body robot experience. We, we believe, I'm, I'm actually at this point, I'd say fairly confident that at some point in the future, we'll be able to restore full body functionality. Neuralink bude meniť milióny životov k lepšiemu, možno miliardy. Predstav si, že tvoj milovaný bude môcť znovu chodiť, alebo rodič s Alzheimerom opäť rozozná svoje dieťa. Naša interakcia s počítačmi je momentálne tak level 0. Klavesnice, dotykové obrazovky a hlas. Level 1 bude o vstupe s rakovými senzormi a výstupe hlasu a gestikulácií. Level 2 – vysokorýchlostný neurálny upload informácií. Level 3 – obojsmerný neurálny prenos. A finálny level bude o kontinuálnej spolupráci Cortexu so superinteligenciou. Kybernetická telepatia je otázkou času. Revolutionize the way we interact with computers, with technology and with information. You will be able to interact with computer with the speed of thoughts. And we can also expand that to AI. And this implant is very special because it is the first time that we're able to add a completely new mode of data transfer into and out of the brain. This next set of images are the wireless implants. And there was a complete evolution that we went through to add the battery, the antenna, the radio, and to make it actually fully implantable. Once it's implanted, it's completely invisible. It's very compact, it's modular, and it's a general platform that you can use in many places in the brain. So what's next? We're gonna be increasing our manufacturing so that we don't just produce, you know, a certain, like a small number of implants per year, but thousands and then eventually millions of implants per year. We're also going to be increasing channel count. More channels means more neurons are sensed, which means more capabilities. In some sense, we often think a lot about the, the Moore's law of neurons that we're interacting with. And in the same way that Moore's law propelled forward many subsequent revolutions in computing, we think that sensing more and more neurons will also completely redefine how we interact with computers and reality at large. Slepým od narodenia a ľuďom, ktorí stratili zrak, budú stačiť okuliare s kamerami a implantát vo vizuálnom kortexe, aby mohli znovu vidieť. Simulácia, ako by mohol vyzerať zrak prvej generácie Blindsight. Časom bude očividné, že všeobecná umelá inteligencia bez vysokorýchlostného rozhrania medzi počítačom a mozgom nikdy nenaplní svoj potenciál ako nástroj pre ľudí. Misiou Neuralinku je demokratizácia superinteligencie. What broadband internet did to the 56 kilobit modem is what this hardware is going to do to the brain. We are trying to drastically expand the amount of bandwidth that you have access to to have a much richer experience and superhuman capabilities. Budúcnosť je epická.